Hey everybody, good morning. That was a stage door shut. Welcome to Marathon Mondays with Mal. We are in the middle of nowhere bringing to you a episode to show you behind the scenes of how much dedication and how difficult it is to bring you such a beautiful calendar every year. The 2022 calendar will feature Coach 1340. That's that guy right there, that beautiful H3 double slide. We're going to be bringing you some footage today. We've got the entire marketing team brought up here. Dave Bash is here. So enjoy all this footage. This is what it takes to bring you this amazing calendar every year. And this is going to be the cover. All right, everybody, so still out here on this uh, photo shoot for the calendar. And what Dave is doing right now and what you can see happening is the coach is lowering. Uh, that's part of the airbag system in the coach. He's doing an air dump, which in my opinion is one of the best ways to photograph uh, a coach because it gives it that lower look, uh, more aggressive, especially at night, which is not gonna happen right now, but at night with the ground effect lighting, and the uh, lights on the awning, on the awnings, excuse me, uh, when you do an air dump, you'll see just how much lower. And you can see that Dave dropped it down to a position where the mud flaps there on that front tire are uh, dragging on the ground right now. It gives it more of a sleek look, uh, a little bit, a little bit lower than drive height. So that's kind of what he was doing, and we're going to be out here for a little bit longer and uh, get some more footage. Got cars coming through here. It's a quiet campground up here. Uh, we're right off of Clear Lake, about an hour and a half, like I told you, from Coburg, from um, the Marathon corporate headquarters. And coming out here and getting this footage uh, is one of those opportunities where it gives me a chance to show you guys, the viewers, the people that uh, love Marathon, that are Marathon owners, just how far it takes uh, to market these products uh, properly because anybody can just throw some items up on the website but what we we do everything from uh, calendars to brochures and these will be some some pictures that we can actually use uh, for a long time now Pete's standing right here Pete I wanted to ask you a question about when you are looking for a location to shoot the calendar you and I have had several discussions about this Tell us the process, if you can, quickly about what what you do to find a proper location for the calendar after so many years. Well, it gets harder and harder. Right. Uh, this year, I got lucky. The boss wanted, he actually suggested lava flows, and of course, we have them all over Oregon. So, uh, 
Uh, Clear Lake is some place I'm familiar with. I knew there's lava flows around here. I got lucky. I, I looked on the satellite maps and saw that this backside road around the back of the lake, there was lava flow across it. Uh, so in this case, geez, we went here, we went all the way to Bend, we went to Smith Rock. Uh, we've been through most of the major Cascade Lakes. And that, that, right, that right there will tell you guys uh, even furthermore the commitment. Last year for the 2021 calendar, uh, in my opinion, and I've looked at all of the calendars historically over the years, and we've done this for 25 years-ish, something like that. Um, last year was down in uh, Tillamook, Oregon. And for those of you who know the Tillamook uh, area down in the Oregon coast, there is a museum down there that's basically, it's, a, it's an air museum, and it used to be a World War II blimp facility where they built these amazing blimps. And um, Pete and Mickey uh, found this great location and scouted it, and we had two amazing coaches. And for those of you who haven't seen the 2021 calendar cover, it is, the bar was raised. Yeah, was the bar really was raised. Awesome. A good, but hard problem to deal with the next year. <laughs> yeah, it is, but you know, a big shout out to them because they were real friendly. They gave us the run of the place to go in and shoot and wonderful people. Uh, I will say about for here, uh, one of the things we like to do is when we got people that come through for service, this location, Clear Lake, is about an hour and a half from home base. And the neat part about it is, is if you're here getting your coach worked on, yes, they have a little restaurant here, a boathouse. You can rent rowboats. You can rent kayaks. Uh, usually gets very little wind. Uh, you can even go scuba diving here, but it's a great place to come and spend the day. A lot of fun. Uh, it's gorgeous. The water is crystal clear. That's the reason why they don't allow motorboats mm. on. You can't even use an electric motor on this, this lake. So if you got, you need something to do, this is a great place. And that's a good point. Uh, the marketing team has spent many years and that's no joke over the, over the years, they've spent a lot of time finding locations that are close to the mothership, close to our headquarters, where people can go and enjoy themselves when they come to visit Marathon, whether it be first timers to Marathon or people who have been to Marathon multiple times. There are places that are as close as five minutes away in the city of Coburg yep. or an hour and a half like here we are up here in Clear Lake on the way to Bend Sun River. So a big thanks to Pete uh, and our marketing team who brought us up here. We're gonna have some great footage up here and I'm excited for this uh, lava flow. The last question I wanna ask you is, how old do you think this lava flow is, <laughs> right? Is, uh, I mean, this has been here for thousands of years, hundreds of years, what's the word on the streets? Who knows? Right. I, I, haven't, I haven't looked up the history. It is fascinating because if you look at it, it doesn't look that old, but obviously there's a forest erupting right out of it. Yeah. So it's a real unique, beautiful place. Yeah, that's great. So be yourself and do good things. We're gonna have a lot more footage for you, but thanks for joining us on this uh, episode here up at Clear Lake, Oregon for Marathon Mondays. Thanks you guys.